Hey, hey, Gemini. Welcome to my channel, Tea Girl Magic Tarot. Here to do a reading for G -G 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 Gemini, my Gemini's. You guys are my stars. What's going on, Gemini? How's everyone doing? Welcome new subscribers, new people, new family, cross watchers. Everybody here, welcome. Thank you. Uh, I hope everyone is doing well, okay? Um, this is a general message from a Gemini's. It's not going to resonate. So just take the messages. Y'all know the drill. All right, choir, come to the front. I'm just getting these cards ready. Y'all know how I be. One, two, three. Oh, T-Girl, T-Girl, magic and collective. T-Girl, 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 magic and collective. T-Girl, T-Girl, magic and collective. Come check us out and see what we're about. Mm. We sing Gemini, 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 yeah, yeah, Gemini, 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 Gemini. We sing Gemini, 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 Yeah, let's give the choir a round of applause thank you guys so much i ask as you come in can y'all hit a thumbs up for your sister help us get the algorithm in and get the messages out to everybody please thank you namaste anyway jim and i um you already know like i said the drill we don't know what's gonna be so we're gonna see what the overall energy okay some of you guys are holding on to some money saving so some of you guys should be saving some money at this time okay um yeah you're working real hard do you got hard at work? So, so save your money, Gemini. Okay, somebody's holding on to you, though, honey. Okay, so, mm, what's going on? This somebody's sad, Gemini. <laughs> I'm all somebody's sad. Who's sad, Gemini? In your energy, are you sad, or somebody around your energy is sad? They holding on to you. You working hard, Gemini. You making a lot of money right now. Okay, so make sure you save. But somebody in your energy is all sad and depressed. I'm tired of sad and depressed energy in y'all energy, even though it's not your energy. But well, we cannot control the energies, okay? Oh, I forgot to say, Holy Spirit, ancestors, ascended masters of the highest white light, pure love only. How dare do I ever start a reading without asking the highest white, the most high God, Yahweh Elohim, the, the ascended masters, you know, the Holy Spirit to guide this reading. Okay, that's who guides all of our readings. Well, my readings. <laughs> I can't say anybody else's reading. But um, we want to call the right spirits in, right? So to help us with clarity and things like that. But anyhow, someone's really, really sad. They wish they would have worked on something with you, Gemini, and held on to you. And then they would have been victorious and successful as well. So, yeah, somebody's sad because they're not victorious and successful. This person wanted to be seen by other people. They didn't want to be seen by you, Gemini. They too busy being seen. Look at, look at me, showing off, showing out and shit. And you busy hard at work, saving your money, building your empires. Look at your empires in the background, okay? Holding on to all the coins and the dimes right now. Okay, Gemini, that's right. Manifesting your own dreams. Look at you. Entering into new contracts. So some of you guys are about to get a brand new contract, okay? Going into a new work Get a new work contract for a lot of you, okay? Because um, to me, the devil is contract as well. And with the four of pentacles, that's a money card. With the eight of pentacles, work. So, uh, so you guys are going to enter into a new work contract. Someone's real sad because they see you making a lot of moolah at work, Gemini. This is with this energy this person is in. This makes them heartbroken. How oh, somebody, you know, that's nothing but jealousy. Ain't nothing but jealousy. With the six of wands and the devil, that's jellyoso, okay? That makes them sad that you're making money. What kind of... And then they want to heal this with you. I'm confused. Oh, this person might be facing some legal problems now. They got them stuck. Child, yeah, they stressed out right now. Drinking and shit. Talking about you. Mad that you mad. I mean, mad that they mad. That you healing. Moving forward. Forward movement. Victory and success. Manifesting your best life. While they're stuck like Chuck all up in their sad head. Can't sleep at night, anxious, stressed out. Okay, they might be on some type of, what is that, lorapasm for anxiety if they can afford it. Okay, not to say, because everybody may not be able to, they don't even know, but they on some kind of something. Okay, because they're stressed out and they can't sleep. 
at night. It could be a Gemini. It could be a sign such as yourself, Geminis, okay? It could be a fire sign. could be an earth sign. could be an Aquarius. could be in a Cancer, a Capricorn. could be all of these signs, Gemini, or any of them. But this Capricorn, this Gemini, or Aquarius, Cancer energy, um, could be a little bit of Scorpio with these cups up here. Um, I'm painting the Pisces too. Uh, they're sad and they're, they're because they didn't heal something with you, okay? Now they're facing legal problems that's caused a complete halt in their life while you celebrating shining, 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 Gemini. Gemini's winning. And this is the truth, okay? You got, yeah, your pinnacles are looking good. Gemini, you go. Okay, what else is going on? Why is this person so sad? Oh, because you're manifesting your best life. You was the queen of wands. You was the empress. Oh, they had you. They was looking at you like the queen of wands with your legs open. So they was looking like you, at you. Oh, some of them thought you was the prostitute, child, with this queen of wands and the eight of pentacles. Oh, so they're heartbroken because you're not a prostitute. <laughs> you're the empress. Whatever you be a male, you're an emperor, okay? You're the star. You're a rising star. Some of them are sad because they see you on this public platform, healing, being nurturing, giving guidance, growing things, working hard, having victory and success, and fast forward movement, manifesting your own life right now. And this person is in regret that they didn't put in work with you and they should have held on to you so they could have been celebrating and successful with you. That's the truth. But instead, they was being toxic and they was being devil-like and they was trying to win up and break your heart because they thought you was the queen of wands, low-key prostitute. But they really wanted you to be the mother of their child. But then... Anyway, that's a whole other story because then they would have been able to hold on to you, but they're sad and regretful that they didn't get you pregnant, okay? Because if they would have got you pregnant, they felt that they would have been able to heal something with you as they went off in victory and success and manifested something else with somewhere. Oh, they think, oh, they think, okay. So some of them are sad because they can't use you for bail money, jail money, whatever money, it's these legal situations that they in right now. Not for everybody, but for a lot of y'all, okay? They... They, they can't use you for whatever they need to use you to get them out these jimmy jams, okay? They want to heal with you, but they can't. They stuck. They don't have no, they don't have really too much to offer. They don't have no money because they're imbalanced. This person is imbalanced. Why are they imbalanced, angels? What caused this person to be imbalanced? Their flighty, whore-like ways with this page of wands and their foolish ways of taking leaps of faith everywhere in everybody's ponds, lying, sneaking, conning people. Okay, that's why they're sad. That's why they're in this energy. That's why they don't have no money. Mm-hmm. Yeah, lying. And when they're in a marriage, lying to people when they're in a marriage. Okay. And that's why they're in this energy. So it's pretty much karma. So they're in balance right now. Yeah, and that's things have been revealed. Okay, yep. So what else is going on, Angel? So now, yeah, they heavily burdened. Ooh, let me hold on. Let me flip these around. What else, angels? Tell us more about this person. Why is this person in deeper quick? What are their intentions on my Gemini? Why are they trying to come back? What is happening? Yeah, they're trying to, they're trying to come back real quick. They're trying to come back and make you not... They're trying to confuse you, number one, because this is not quick movement, not think hard, just do it, okay? They want you to be in your emotions. This person's trying to try to do something really quick to make you in their emotions, and they're figuring out they may ask you to marry them with this Empress card, or they want some type of... Oh, they want, yeah, they want, oh, mm-mm, mm-mm. They want to heal something to keep you stuck. They want to give you some type of offer. I'm feeling like they want to offer you their seed, number one. They want to heal with you, mix these fluids and juices, okay, with this devil up over here because they feel that that's going to mend your heart, their heartbreak. Yeah, they're sad, yeah. Okay, what else? Yeah, they want to come to you as the king of cups energy. Hmm, what is the seven of swords? Yeah, they're sad because their lies got them caught up. Their lies got them stuck. Their lies ca caused them a tower. Hmm, hmm, hmm. So who, wow. so tell us more. So what else? So their lies caused a tower. They got them stuck. Mm hmm so now they're trying to want, now they're looking back at the past, even though I don't see the six of cups, but they are because they're looking back. At the past, trying to look into their future, looking towards you because you're the world as they hold the world in their hands because you're the magician, you're the manifester. Right now, you got the keys. You're the empress. You're on top. And this person literally is looking at the empress being, they're sad and sad and depressed and in regret. So now they're looking back, like I said, at the past, 
saying, hmm, I think I might want to invest in some equal give and take to Gemini now. Because see, Gemini, they didn't have you. This person just wants power and authority over you. There's a lot of red. Okay, this person got a red cape on. See this person you met dealing with? Now they want to come back to take control. They want they got a red cape on. You see this person? They had a manipulative energy. They're trying to manifest you back. And they got a red cape on. They want power and control over you. You see, this person's stuck right here. Now they're in their heart chakra space, feeling all sad and crying and because they're like they're waiting for their ships to come in. Ain't nothing moving for them. So they're trying to open up their heart chakra, but they still want control. Okay, look, childlike, child, they all in their feelings now because they've been broken down like a pound, shit. They only got a little bit of coinage. Maybe they may be a beggar, low-key, low-key, borderline begging, but they got that red hat on, that red scarf. They still want control, and you know what's over their head crown. I mean, they crown area. We got the red over here with the six of wands. Him got a red uh, cape on, wanting victory. Control, control, look, control. They just want control over you. Here we go, another control. We got the knight of wand, a knight of uh, swords in control. We got him. Control. They want to hold on to you because they just want control. Mother, oh, just cut y'all. Just too much control. This person is too manipulative and controlling. Child, and they still got red tights on. Look, okay. Want control, okay? This person need to control their loins is what the spirit's telling me, yeah? Because as I put, say, the control their loins, and look, so some of them might need to control their loins because um, some of them need to be need to get checked out from the hospital, okay? Call 911 because they doing too much. Whew, that's a lot. Mm, you look at King of Swords trying to come out. Control, okay? I should have named this video Control. This person want to come back and take control, but they too sad and depressed and decrepit to kind of try Take back control. They've been wounded. What had happened? What had happened with this person to feel in their energy? I thought they was gone off to Pr Priscilla or Johnny or whoever. Or oh, whoever. They left their ass out in the cold, honey. Left them homeless, homeless, crunchy, thirsting, sleeping, busting, leaking, whatever. And they went to Conver Waters with somebody else. So that's what happened with Priscilla and Johnny. They left the prison. So now this person's feeling defeated, okay? Priscilla and Johnny defeated your person, so your person's hungry, they're they're crunching, they're sad, they're working hard, but no matter how hard they work, they got to hold on to everything that they have because they're, they're, they're drinking it away, it's a lot of toxic energies around your person right now, they're not in a good energy, they're depressed, they don't know what to do, they're trying to get back at you, so they figured out, well, maybe if I can't beat them, join them, let me get into my emotions and try to have me a spiritual awakening too. Because I'm in balance right now, okay? This person's juggling, yeah. This is really revealed to them as long, this is why. Yeah, so things have been illuminated to you. Things have been illuminated to them. Some of them had a baby that's got them, oh, juggling and Ill, imbalanced in their emotions, okay? But things have been illuminated to you. This person's in their feelings because they look at you as the sun, the happiness, the one, the illuminated one. They see you manifesting your best life. And yeah, what's this three of so three of wands energy angels? What's this over here? Woo! They honey, they, they ain't no new beginning. So something stuck with Chuck. Okay, something stuck with Chuck. Okay, yeah. Dang, they passionate for you though. Yep, they want they want a brand new beginning with you with this Ace of Wands though. They're waiting for the right time. They're manifesting. So they've done some type of magic, actually. Yes, they have with this Ace of Pentacles energy and the magician right here. And then they're waiting for this magic or whatever they've done for this brand new beginning, okay? Because right now they're single. Of course they're single. They don't, they're, they're homeless, okay? You, you're single, abundant, and sexy because you choose to be, okay? And your love is coming on its way. Those of you that are looking for it and wanting it or you're just exercising self-love right now, okay, with this Two of Cups energy, but this person did try to do a love spell on you, okay, because they want to keep you single so they can make this love offer to you, okay? That makes my stomach hurt for some of y'all. I'm sorry. Yeah, because they're woundy. See how this low wounded energy? Because you guys have been through a battle with this person, okay? You guys have been through the fire, through everything, and y'all are just tired, okay? Yeah, y'all are just ready to walk away and lay everything down with this person, okay? Okay? Um, this person's a heavy burden. They always make excuses for themselves and why they can't move forward, why they always broke, why they always drinking. They can't tell the truth to save their life. It's always someone else's fault. 
You know what I mean? Can I borrow a dollar, Craig? Always. Can I borrow something? My check ain't came in the, you know, I didn't get my check yet. You know what I mean? It's easier for you, Gemini, because you're the master, you're the manifester, high vibe, Gemini, okay? And so this person is draining. Look, these two energies don't even belong together, okay? So that's why you're deciding to walk away, okay? Woo, Gemini. And this person, well, as you walking away, child, this person running up right behind you. Okay, they running up behind you, Gemini. Somebody coming right up behind you, want to offer their cup because they feeling wounded and imbalanced. And now they want to invest in you, Gemini, and give equal take because they feel defeated right now. So all they have is this to offer you. Okay, they're going to make it. Actually, they're going to lie and say they're going to offer you the Ace of Pentacles. This is the big, this is the big thing. This is the generational wealth. But all they are is this. They're going to have the, these two pinnacles don't even match, number one. So it's a lie as they're coming in already. Because I believe the seven of swords did try to come out. But anyway, this person is a liar. Well, the five of swords, and that's just as bad. So they want to win at all costs. And that's why they're going to come back and tell you I want a two of cups situation, which you really, truth be told, they want to ace up. Look, so they can feel they can get out of this stuck situation because this is too much stuckness. They want to offer you this ace. Ace to make it look like this because they're juggling right now. Okay, they're they're not moving. They're trying to look at things from a different way, and so now this is why they want to offer you that Gemini. Okay, because they can't sleep at night. Okay, yeah, but I know I see the Seven of Swords up here, so they're gonna be lying to you about this too. Cause see, they try to leave somebody behind, but somebody is right hot tail on their tracks. They got red shoes and red hat. They still trying to have control even after they lying and sneaking away, leaving evidence all behind. They're going to run, child. Mm -mm. What else, Gemini? What's this devil? <sighs> the emperor. This person's narcissistic. They just want control and power. Yeah. Yeah, but because you laid things to rest with this person. Yeah. you were. This person thought you were going to be their meal ticket, Gemini. That's the truth with this three of celebration, three of cups energy, okay? This person is co-dependent, very controlling, narcissistic. I'm not a doctor, but the devil and the emperor together, y'all know what that is, okay? In the tarot world, that is a narcissistic energy, and they want control over you. Yeah, this is a queen of wands, and they're in their feminine energy at this time, too. This is a masculine in his feminine energy operating in the queen of wands, but they're toxic, trying to be the emperor because they want control or have kids. I don't, for some of y'all, they have empires. They run stuff, and they do a magic on you, okay, to break your heart, to keep you stuck. Okay, to keep you in balance and juggling, but it's backfiring on them because they're left out in the cold right now. Okay, and they're stuck, and that's why they want to come and work on this with you. What else, angels? What does this person want to say to Gemini if they could say something to Gemini? Let's get these cards. What, angels, what would this person say to Gemini if they could say something to Gemini? Okay, what would they say? What would their higher self say? That's what I want to know. What would this person's higher self say? If they was in their right mind, Gemini, okay? Because the, the narcissistic people we hear, they can't love anybody. They don't even love themselves, let alone love, them, you know, someone else. So it's impossible. I hear. That's what I heard in the streets. Narcissists don't love people. They don't even love themselves. They just use people. What else, angels? Nothing. That's all. Gemini people don't want to say nothing. High. There's nothing for their higher self that want to say nothing. I was about to say. Angels, what? We're kind of, okay. Let's see. Get a couple more. All right. Ooh. All right. The higher self would say, I would do the same thing in a different way to hold on to you, Gemini. That's what they say. Okay. And this person also say, I'm running away from myself. So they really running away from themselves. They haven't addressed. That's what narcissistic people do. They run from themselves. And they say, I'm jealous of your light. Yeah, because they adore. You see, the devil done showed up with the emperor. They're jealous of your light. They want control of you. See all that? Control. Okay, they want to control your light. They want to dim your light. That's why they, a lot of them try to make you feel left out in the cold. A lot of them ghosted you, trying to make you feel less than. Okay? But you really, you were the prize the whole time. You were the empress. Okay? They couldn't stop your shine. They couldn't stop your light. They couldn't stop your growth. They couldn't stop your flow. Period, poo. And this person would say, they say, well, they would. They, the higher self would tell you because the narcissist is not going to tell you this. 
that I have childhood woundings that I haven't healed. So they have childhood woundings that they haven't healed. And they want to know, is it too late for them, you guys, to start all over again? Okay? And they say, I can't get this right. They can't get it right because they won't admit to who they are. They're a wounded warrior. They're always blaming other people for their mishaps. Okay? That says, I am afraid you'll never feel love. Wait. I am afraid you'll never feel love for me again. And you're absolutely right, sirs or ma'ams. Okay? Because Gemini has healed. They're growing and they have evolved. I mean, they love you, but they are not in love with you the way you feel that they should be in love with you. They're loving you from a distance, okay? Says, you are too good for me, absolutely. This is a, this is a, look at this. Absolutely, Gemini is too good for you. Look at this beautiful energy. And look at this nasty-ass, diabolical, narcissistic energy. Yes, Gemini, you are absolutely too good for this energy. Absolutely, Absolutely. Look at this. You're absolutely too good for this energy. Okay. And the spirits say that's the truth. And what else? So you good, you too good for them, Gemini. And you are the wind beneath my wings. Okay. The codependency, just like I said. This person's codependent. You can't help them. They try to expect you to help them out of homelessness, honey. And you can't even do that. This is a grown, this is a grown, full, whole, knobby, needed, tall. This person could be tall, don't have to be. They could be short with feet problems, okay? They probably have a foot injury or something. Maybe the karmic disc ran over their foot. I don't know what had happened. But they say, I know who you are to me. To me. So this person knows who you are to them. But who are you, Gemini? We don't want to ask the narcissist that question. But this is coming from their higher self. So that must mean that they know that you're the empress, okay? I pray for you every night. Sir, ma'am, please don't pray for my collective every night because we don't know who the hell you pray to, okay? For you to be the way that you are, we don't want you praying for them, okay? Don't pray for them, okay? Um, I hope you forgive me like you used to. Yeah, no, Gemini's awake now, sir, ma'am. They're not going to forgive you. I mean, Gemini, just agree with me. Give me a thumbs up if you agree with me on this one, okay? Um, this is where the energies that my high vibes are feeling right now. Okay, I'm just feeling that I'm just picking out all that up. Okay, so my ego has shattered and I have nothing. Of course, I have nothing, nothing, nothing. Okay, so yeah, Gemini's close that door. Okay, so sir, you have nothing. I don't know what to tell you. You need to start working on yourself, investing in yourself. Okay, making better choices, cutting off toxic people, places, and things that don't serve you. Okay, get out of your ego, please. And then that is when you'll come up a little bit, sir or ma'am. Okay, what else are we going to say? I can't let you outshine me. And that is the problem. There's no let. Ain't no let in this. Gemini's outshining. High vibe is outshining. They're shining no matter what. Shining, 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 shining. They can't help it. See, this is what I'm talking about. You shining, Gemini. This person's pissed off that you shining, of course, because you irritate the devil's demons, Gemini. Okay? And then I'm in financial ruins. We know this, sir. We just seen it. Okay? They're in financial ruin. The karmic cleaned me out. I'm broke. Yeah, Priscilla done cleaned him out, honey. Done had them babies and stuff by him. Yeah, this emperor taking all the money and everything. Mm, mm, mm. I really miss making. I really miss making love to you. I, was it love? Because the Gemini remembers the energies that you left them in. Was this, ma'am or sir? Okay. Um, I projected my feelings on you. Absolutely, you did. And this is what narcissistic people do. They project their insecurities and their negativity on high vibe to try. Because, like I said before, your light irritates this devil's demons. Mm -hmm. So I'm so lost right now. Yeah, who else is lost? Gemini, nobody lost but the devil. So your person's pretty much lost out there. They say you're the true soulmate, but you know what? You are. You were their lesson. Lesson well learned, okay? I'm jealous of your glow up and I'm mad it wasn't me. And that is the only reason why they're trying to come back to fuck that up too. But don't let them, Gemini. This is why they in this energy. Uh-oh, the magician done turned in reverse, child. So they trying to be manipulative, okay? Woo! You're not answering, unblock me. L losing it, panic. So this person's losing it. They panic because you ain't answering. They phone calls, you got them blocked. Oh, and the reason you got them blocked because they say I like variety 
That's just how I, I am. But I still love you because they're a hoe, okay? They're a toxic, narcissistic hoe. They got chains. They got they make spiritual ties and, child, they make spiritual ties with all of their fake friends around them because they sleep with all their fake friends around them. And then this person's saying, I'm embarrassed of their life right now. Exactly, because you're an old person, grown, full, able-bodied person right now, and you're out in poverty, facing homelessness, okay? Um, and I didn't mean to betray and lie on you. I was broken. No, you are broken, and I smile in your face, but honestly, I want to take your place. Exactly. We say they were jealous of you, Gemini. I'm not ready, nor will I ever let you go. Okay, that's a narcissistic person. You were the best thing that I ever had. Of course you were, because you're the empress. Durr. And I'm holding on to you for dear life. It hurts me to let you go. Oh, my God. And I'm going to creep up on that ass. So, Jim and I, watch out, because this person feels like I'm running out of time. Ooh, child. And they feel like their prayers is going unheard, honey. So, I don't know, Jim and I. They might be creeping up on you shortly. I don't know. Y'all get y'all uh, self spiritual bath, self-protection. This is a full moon this weekend. Okay, I believe when you see this video, it'll be full moon on this day. Okay, they are doing magic love spells to kind of rear you in. It's not working because you guys are so highly elevated right now. It's just bouncing back and forth, and that's why they're in this energy trying to plot, plan, and strategize how to bring you back. But all right, Gemma, that has been your reading loves. I hope this has helped someone. Until the next time, I love you all. Bye.